Now in this problem, we're told that a rectangular wading pool has a length that is 2.5 meters longer than the width. And we're also told that the area of the pool is 37 meters squared. And in the question, we're asked to find the dimensions, so the length and the width, to the nearest centimeter. And remember that there's, uh, in one meter, there's 100 centimeters. So we're going to use the information in the question to assign variables here. And we could use uh, W for width, but unfortunately, a lot of my students get mad at me when I use anything other than X for these types of problems. So I'm going to say let X represent the width of the pool. And I'm going to let X plus 2.5, which is um, the width plus 2.5, is the length of the pool. And we're also told that the area, remember, is 37 meters squared. And what we have to uh, remember is the formula for area of a rectangle, and area is equal to length times width. I'm going to rewrite this formula so that I'm as width times length is equal to area. So that now we're going to um, put in for the width x, the length is x plus 2.5. Remember the area is equal to 37. So all I'm doing is subbing into the formula here for width is x, length is x plus 2.5, and the area is 37 meters squared. So now I'm going to use the distributive property to expand here, and x times x is x squared, and x times 2.5 is 2.5x. So now I'm going to rearrange this to put it into a quadratic equation. So I'm going to su uh, subtract 37 from both sides, so then we've got x squared plus 2x minus 37 is equal to 0. Now, this is going to be very difficult or almost impossible to uh, factor using um, factoring trinomials. So what we're going to do in a case like this, and especially since you know, 37 is a prime number, uh, we're going to use the quadratic formula. So I've rewritten the equation here, and we're going to use our quadratic formula, which is negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over divided by 2a. And we're going to identify a, b, and c here. a is 1, that's the coefficient on the x squared term. b is 2.5, that's the coefficient on the x term. And c is equal to negative 37. So now we're going to sub into the equation, and I'm not going to go through all this, but this is what you should have gotten uh, if you'd have subbed in correctly. And when you uh, simplify, um, I tell my students not to write all these steps down, but I'm including them just to see in case you made a calculator error, you might want to check on your numbers. And what you end up with then is x is equal to 4.96, and I'll explain why I've, um, rounded to two decimal places in just a second, and x is equal to negative 7.46. So in the one case here, and I'll go back to where these two numbers come from, uh, we, this is uh, in our formula, remember we have plus or minus, here is the example of where, where we're adding uh, the square root of b squared minus 4ac, and here is the exam, uh, situation where we're subtracting it. Now x, remember, represents the width. So we can automatically eliminate the negative 7.46 because we cannot have a negative width. So our solution then is going to be x is equal to 4.96. And the reason we round to two decimal places here is because uh, if we this is in meters. And if we uh, are going to look at the centimeters, then remember the centimeters are 1 one hundredth, or we're going to round to the nearest one hundredth of a meter. So the width is x, and that means that the length is x plus 2.5. And so our width then is 4.96 meters, and our length then, uh, sorry, and that would be 496 centimeters. And so what we've done is rounded to the nearest centimeter here. And our length is 7.46 meters, which is 746 centimeters. So again, we've rounded to the nearest centimeter in both cases. So we're going to check this now. The area of the pool, remember, is length, area is length times width, 7.46 times 4.96. And it's a good idea to try this to check your solution on your calculator. You get approximately 
I think it's off by one one thousandth of a, of a place, is approximately 37 meters squared. So therefore, the length of the pool is 7.46 7 meters and the width is 4.96 meters.